into a fizzy show. I can't wait to play with my boat. I can't wait to play with it. Whoa, look. A huge paddle. Should I? <laughs> Whoa, that was fun. I'm going to put my boat on the puddle and see what happens. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 no! My boat, it sunk! I have an idea. I'll use this stick to try and get my boat back. No, no! That didn't work. What do I do? What do I do? Fizzy! I've got to find Fizzy! <laughs> Hmm, now I just gotta test this to see if it works. <laughs> what is it, Phoebe? I put my boat in a puddle and it sank. <gasps> it sank? It did. I tried to poke it out with a stick and that sank too. No way. Hmm. Does that mean my boat's too heavy? It sure does, Phoebe. But how do we know what's heavy and light if we don't test it first? <sighs> We can learn. <laughs> Miss Hands, we're going to need a hand. Hi, Fizzy and Phoebe. Oh, my goodness, this looks really heavy. Let me help you with that. Here we go. Oh, my word, this is so heavy. There we go. So what are you guys doing today? The sink or float experiment. With this tank. Oh, I see. Hey, did you notice you have a little fish in your tank? Hey, fishy fishy. Can you see me? I'm sure he can see you, Phoebe. But we're going to have to get this little guy out of there so we can start your experiment. Here we go, little fella. Carefully, carefully, carefully. Let's put you in this water here. Awesome! What's next, Miss Hands? Well, we're going to need some things to put into our fish tank. <gasps> Fizzy, let's have a race. Who can find the most items the quickest? <laughs> Your challenge is accepted, Phoebe. <laughs> <laughs> In here, let's add them one by one to the tank and see if they float or sink. Okay, and our first item is a giant red crayon. Look at that. Okay, let's drop it in. Three, two, one. It floats! And now we have this super cute dinosaur squishy. Look at all those colors in there. Look at his belly. That's so funny. Okay, in you go. He's floating too. Ooh, let's try this frying pan. It sank. And look at these cute little squishy fruits we've got here. They're so squishy. Look at that. And we have a whole bowlful. Let's put them all in. Whoa, look, they're all floating. Hey, we have two spoons. What do we think? Will they float or sink? Speed round, a squishy. What do you think? Will it float or sink? Sink! Play Doh, what do you think? Will it float or sink? Sink! The pet vet stethoscope. 
What do we think? Will it float or sink? Float! Wow, this is really cool, Miss Hands. But how do we know what would sink? Yeah, and how do we know what will float? Well, if you guys can find an item that you think can do both, I can explain exactly how it works. Awesome sauce! Miss Hands, what about this oozy doozy? And oozy doozy is perfect. But first, let's empty the tank. So what do we think? Will it float or sink? It's floating! Now, things sink or float because when they are put into water, there is an upward push. For example, this oozy doozy is floating because it has a low density. But look, if we open it up and allow the water inside, it sinks! The upward push from the water doesn't work anymore because it is too dense, making it heavy. So, how do we know the oozy doozy's density? By how solid and compact it is. The tighter the little atoms are pushed together, the more dense it becomes. Let's try some other things. Oh, that sounds fun! I'll show you an item and you guess whether it will float or sink. You ready? Ready! Glitter! Float! You're right, Fizzy. It floats. Can I put something in? Sink! My unicorn! Well, I think we should end it there, Phoebe. I'm not so sure your unicorn would like that. No. Okay, Fizzy. This was so fun! <laughs> it sure was, Phoebe. Aw, it's a shame your boat sank. Yeah, it was just the density. <laughs> Oh, and Miss Hands, can we add the fish back to his tank, please? Sure we can. Hey, little fishy. Aw, he's happy again. Thanks for watching. We hope you all have a fizzy, fantastic day. We will see you next time.